ACP Benjamin Abazo has been granted a self-cognizance bill by a criminal high court in Accra. ACP Abazo and 10 others have been charged for attempted coup aimed at overthrowing the Akufu Ado led administration. Now, this morning on Daily Run, we are looking at events after his arrest and what should happen now that he has been granted a self recognizance bill. This is the Daily Run. Let's keep talking. I um, say the political actors in the system no? and uh, the judicial service is using bill conditions as a means of punishment to ordinary citizens. The officer in question, Onye Small Boy Bia was security service in him. He is a distinguished service officer. And the reason here, Emma Yechino, Emma Yedini Tumunu, in this case, he suspects that he was born in Krofobis or Muntu Abayeningu. Now, before Paul mentioned, one of the reasons your mama and I say, Omo Ma, your investigation for the past 20 months or so, and Omo was every reason, any grounds to say, indeed, he is culpable of the crime. In this case, who was in evidence say, Papa, no, we this are born now. Why then do you remind him in the police custody or prison custody for that long period and send a woman uh, bail? No? You could have proceeded to court direct to prosecute him. How long will you take for you to establish that somebody is not involved? After you've indicated that about 20 good moms revealed that ACP Agozo was involved. So you look at the person's caliber and the role he's playing. And if even it establishes, it shouldn't take the police too long to know that this person, we can easily get him by getting his passport, letting him go home and still follow him. Because he wasn't the only person in which they were invited. There were other people. But he was narrowed down to still stay longer. It means that there were other clues that were leading to the fact that they would still get some information. Now, but no matter how long it takes his time around, you mention your name, it gets to a stage that they realize that they will have to leave him. And that was what people in the court of public opinion, that if you handle it that way, it goes to point out to the fact that it is political motivated. And when that lens is used, the investigation is compromised in a way because people will not understand that you are looking for something. In fact, uh, Ghana, sometimes, you know, I send me banner, you can say, you didn't hear you read politics into it. I shall say, no, I pray you say, I say, no. Look, ACP, Dr. Agbozo, or a senior police officer, the people monitored them for some time, 50 months. Into all the role that you played on WhatsApp platform, everything, no, was monitored. There was video recording, etc. Manufacturing of uh, bombs and everything. They were all picked up. Into a near exceptional matter, another day, BB day, because all year BB in Sida, what you know, all of them. Now, bailable offense, oh, but even if the uh, offense or no, a uh, bailable or no, local court to crimes will feel there, or BB be interfering investigations, they will they, they will not get, grant you the bail. In this say, Nim, let's have a catch at Bia, in a BB in Sina, one to more money in a. You cannot tell them what to do, they know their job. They want no senior police who ought to know better. Incident, let's allow our, our this and the laws you know, to work. Let the court deal with the matter. Yeah, Eric. I think now, yes, we all agree that the courts will deal with the matter. But sometimes, let's be very frank. The security officers themselves allow the debate that we are having. If they know, they, they you need to answer some questions. That is why they say he has been invited to the police to go and interrogate and provide some information. But what we see is that Onyantechi or whoever is at the airport, they are picking the person. When at the end of the day, we can handle some of these things professionally without necessarily increasing the political temperature. So the discussion as to who is making the political is depend on how investigations are being carried. In Jai court, in the court, in the end, you might be who resort. My typical example, uh, Mr. Gregory Afoku. Court now you are Juma. Amano a uh, verdict and a bill so on Kofi. Yet the state is still holding Gregory Afoku as a prisoner of the state. You get it? Into when court been in it maybe. Uh, Doctor Agojo is not a small boy in the security system. The uh, the way Omar handled this issue on it has demoralized the security service. Oh yeah, security officer, senior officer now who name one Kasani because as it is now, the security is infiltrated by unprofessional uh, members. Ah, Omo di Omo ba abemu. It you only will cast anyone and train you now. It will be used against you. Yeah, or see or draft a statement. The man say, and that will be my honor. Now, me draft a statement. The man 
na uyu statement does he mean i've helped you carrying out a crime ah nenye ma edina na the content of the statement na have you been read out to the public in any case the argument is that omo of full evidence of what the man has done what else do you need apart from going to court so why are you holding the person as a, a fugitive or a, a, a criminal person? Who have you seen? Proceed to court and try the person within a month or two. You prosecute the person, you take him to prison. Now the now say prison almost ourselves almost about three to four months now. You have infringed upon the right of the uh, person under the current dispensation. Obia into me you suit you into a Bambia or Ghana has We the ordinary people who vote every government out of government and are in power. In today, should not even entertain any idea. Say, and then yet, change. I go cut to a bobi, cut to a mo. I be no. It will never happen. We will use our time to vote them out. Obi and Kedah Abozo, what could you do? And now the secretary can be that contribution in the charge. Ah, oh, there is a senior police officer who ought to know better. No, he didn't quite the matter. No, that is all. Unless you tell me the the matter. No, or yet or yet, bra, no one did it. No, the group itself, in another boom, no worry. The investigation. In the Obi and whoever played a part. No. When you be in Fimo, we in Nana, we won't worry the assembly. So don't single out Abozo there. As if there, we be the Abozo. We be not care for Afoku. That way, example there. If a typical example is Afoku, then the law is there. Majority of these things contributes to the fact that Yerane Krobia na Ajipino or Chief of Defense Staff depends on how political correct you are. Yerane system na na eba irrespective of Nipano profession. You're yeah, using as Ajipa. And Kadem Yemenina will not have a situation where somebody wants to de develop a testimonial that suggests that Unkofia Oye Demukofu on she is political correct. I am against a situation where the chief of defense car, the head of uh, CID, BNI uh, head, and IGP are politically correct the ruling government. If you go and read about Obama's security couple, was a gentleman who served in the previous as the head of security. Mm. He is seen as a professional, irrespective of his party narrative. That professional security couple is like a medical doctor. You do your professional thing. But as we sit down now, if we don't take that, even security guards to top ministers and top presidential staff, will, they will have to do a transcript on your background to say. And I said that when security is reduced to that, it creates a problem. Secondly, this political witch hunt is something that is a subculture. That we think that let's even allow them to be working in court and wasting their time. The man he had when he say before on poor umbechini no abaya no any need the security apparatus my head as he say almost what evidence we have twenty months. I'm not there yet investigation. Until it only fair say say what chini panna say who believe is am power some are who want a water tight case ah. Just take the issue to court and there are fair judges in the court. They will try the man. But this is a senior police officer for. Almost four months now, we're jailing now. Or that one now, on your shoe now, unborn in charge behind. The junior officers who are looking up to him in terms of performance of their duty, now they are going to make mockery of him. Says your man, Amani Bill. Does he mean say he's going back to his position? Can he go back to his position? And if he cannot go to, what happens to him? Now, Atina Amani Mukura, he will be a suspect in the eye of the junior officers, and they bring a lot of disrespect into the system. So what we remind you be either in prison custody or police custody, or yeah, illegal sometime. Somebody has been remanded. Mm -hmm. Ah, I don't know, on ye, on ye, ebia, or ye, BBC, something forbidden. And the person knows very well. Next step, back at the why there's a senior police officer. Is he above the law? That's the first question. Because he's a senior police officer, no, Mama was remanded. Even if he murders his wife, no, a senior police officer, Mama was remanded for anything, no investigation. You see, they are doing their work. The state claims it has watertight evidence against the man. We should see justice as an expeditious writ so that issues going to court and dragging on for about four, five years, it doesn't serve anybody's interest. Say, so, what the Nipanico courts now were evidence and that actually so about one month, the court should be able to come to a finality with the case. Say, okay, this is what we have determined so far. But every day, young comrade, young comrade, sincerely speaking, I want the state to go ahead to prosecute the case so that we can see whether indeed the claim that they have a watertight evidence is true or otherwise. They say that if a woman delays in the bathhouse, it means that he wants to come out appearing very neat and clean. I want to believe that the investigators delayed 